Okay, this is a dramatic reading of a letter written by Joni Arias to her supporters regarding the recent book written by Jane Velez Mitchell, Exposed, The Secret Life of Joni Arias, read by my wife, Betty. Come on, Betty. To my friends, for this to be effective, you really must take a second or two to imagine each of the following. Imagine this for a moment. Someone publishes a book about you titled Exposed, The Secret Life of... Well, just insert your name here. Go ahead. Imagine it. Say the title out loud with your first and last name. Well... Okay, uh, The Secret Life of Chuck Sampson. <laughs> oh, boy. Feels gross, doesn't it? Oh! This book is filled with nasty lies about you and half-truths, distorted to make you look as inhuman and unsalvageably, not a word, by the way, evil as possible. Imagine that in writing this book, the author or a ghostwriter, don't you know, consulted with a woman you once briefly knew years ago, who stopped being your friend for reasons so esoteric. She sounds like she was reared in the Dark Ages. I think she meant archaic, didn't she? Oh, but at the time, those weren't the reasons she gave you. No, no, she either was dishonest with you or is now with everyone else. But either way, her mission is to trash you. Then imagine, if you will, that this book filled with degrading, embarrassing, spurious details about you, however untrue, is dedicated to someone who used to bully, beat, and abuse you so copiously that your body, mind, especially your mind and soul still bear the scars of these horrific experiences. I'm just curious. Do you think it was horrific for Travis? Imagine also that a portion of the book's sales are donated to a so-called legacy fund bearing the name of the abuser, founded by people whose burning, twisted desire is to watch you die. Die! Now, there isn't much you can do about this book, except to mourn it as a tragic, unnecessary waste of trees, and keep stepping. But wait, there's more. Now imagine this. I am your self-professed friend and supporter, but I buy this very book exposed the secret life of, again, insert your name here, thereby instead supporting all the above and throwing money into the fund named in honor of your abuser and enriching the very people who want you dead. How would my purchase make you feel? Hurt? Betrayed? Disgusted? Would you still consider me a friend? I think not.